Oh. Oh, morning again already. Oh. Yeah, well. Seven o'clock, but it's not really that bright out, is it? Okay, it's coffee time. Hello everyone, I am IA Roadkill and welcome back to Humble Beginnings on No Man's Land by Alien Jim. This is episode 7. Okay, well, I better get to work. It's bright enough out now. Put the coffee down. So last night, after, or between martinis, I rearranged. I had knocked over my stump grinder. See, do I need I don't Yeah, I do need that to grab the water. Alright. Still half asleep. Anyway, we uh last night what we do? We finished fertilizing our new field. So it's all ready to go. Oh, come on ladies. Start a second box of eggs, right? No. I'd like to sell a box of eggs. See how much I might make off of them. Didn't quite swing that corner wide enough, did I? Oh. Guess what? This has got to go up, and that's got to go down. And then you can back up. There you go, boys. Ooh, thirsty this morning. All right. Must be putting on a little weight. You're drinking more. Which is good. I'm all for that. Oh yeah, we're supposed to be getting a new windmill today, too. Maybe we're going to come out and start working on that. I might not be close enough. Oh yeah. There we go. Good thing we got this lift, otherwise we wouldn't be able to haul that water container around. We don't have a ball hitch on this tractor for some reason. There we go. Already. Okay, so... My goodness, the temperature's still not warm enough to plant. Alright, I planned last night where we might cut a new field in. Let me put this lift away and we'll grab the plow.
I guess if we can't plant, we'll just keep making fields. I do want to leave the grassy area to the right here. It doesn't have very many bushes. So I think it will be good for mowing. We own from the stake this way. Pretty much from where our... Well, no, probably from the bushes between the rock and our fence is where the white stake is to this way. But we own all of this over here. I'm thinking about plowing right along the road. Kind of like this. And I'll have to come back and cut down that tree. But we own clear over here to this post. So I think I might just kind of circle around here like this and get rid of all the bushes and shrubs and stuff. And I guess we can come up here. And then I'll just cut straight across, back to the road, and make a field. So, let's see if I can do that. Could have gotten a little closer to the road there. Maybe I'll doctor that up a little later. But now I need to start turning away. And I could have gotten a little closer to the stake. probably won't be able to hire anybody to help me out here. I'll end up doing all of this by myself. Which doesn't bother me. I kind of like the quiet out here of nobody. Yeah, I get to go into the store and see people, but I'm kind of enjoying the quiet of being out here. And I didn't quite plan that good. I'll have to come back and make the top a little wider. Well, you don't want to watch me go around in circles for hours on end, so I'm going to keep doing this. And... I get close to the end or a wild animal comes out and surprises me, I'll let you know.
Oh, it's lunchtime. I'm not quite done. But it's almost done. I'm ready to do something else. Maybe we need to go Maybe we need to go plant a tree. It's warm enough to plant a tree. Oops. You do still need to lime, fertilize, cultivate, fertilize. Before this field is ready to plant. And I was worried I was going to need to make sure I planted wheat to feed the chickens, but and I don't think that's going to be a problem. They're not eating much. That pen will only hold 50 chickens, and that's what I put in there. I get a little extra money. Maybe I need to look at increasing my chicken herd. If I want to get more eggs, I suppose I should find out what the eggs are worth first. Maybe it's not worth selling eggs around here. I would think it would be. Everybody likes his eggs in the morning. Eggs and bacon. Hmm. I got cows, not pigs. Well, expansion plans, I guess. Well, I am going to keep right on working. And I'm going to get this messed up because I can't talk and drive at the same time. I'm going to get this finished up. I'm going to get it fertilized, limed, Cultivated, fertilized. And I'm going to eat a late lunch. And then we'll go plant some trees. How's that sound? I'll be back with you when I get done with this. Well, that was a bummer. I never even thought about running out of lime. I guess we're going to go into the store and buy some more. We're getting down there on funds again. I guess we're not going to do too much buying, are we?
Well, what have we here? This is our lumber drop-off point. They're building something here. Expansion. Oh, what do we got up here? They've started working on the road. Ooh, they're getting it graded out pretty quick. Oh, they're all the way up and around the corner up here. Ooh, that is a big clearing down there. Okay, well, we need to buy some lime. And the lime should be outside. May I borrow your fork truck again? Thank you. Fork truck doesn't like me today. Should just be a simple job of sliding in, lifting up, lifting up, there we go, and set it on the back of the old lady. Look around, see if anybody saw that. No good. Put the tailgate down. No, I don't want to put the tailgate down. We'll hook the pallet on the tailgate and slide it off. But it's got to drop inside first. Like that. Thank you. See you later. Oh, if they're doing the road, I bet my bonus is coming. Right here should be easy access. All right, let's go finish our line job.
Next step, cultivate and then fertilize. But I think I'm tired of working on that field. Let's go plant some trees. Oh, but before we leave, we better get the lime out of the back of the old lady. Um, I guess I gotta drop this off first. Yeah, it'll be good for now. And we need the lift. there. Simple task. Reach out, grab it, lift it up. No problems, right? I like it when it works. Now, let's see if I can put this against the back wall. Without hitting everything. And punching a hole through the back wall. Whoops. Well, that would be good. Alright. Okay, time to go back to the store. I guess before we go, I should take a good overview of what our new field looks like. Crazy looking thing, isn't it? Still have to get rid of the trees, but that looks nice. I should be out of the way if I park here. Well, it looks like it's all tied down. Should be good for a drive. Nobody saw that. And now we can go. Looks like we have four pallets of trees. They're a little messed up, but we can get them to separate when we get to wherever we're going. That's 80 trees, so I can chop down eight trees after I get these planted. And the only question is, where do we go to plant them? Is there... yeah, there's a road to the right here. There it is, I missed it. Let's head out this way. And I guess just find a clearing and we can start.
I'm not quite sure how much area we're going to need for this many trees, but how about up here? Don't know how they got messed up like that. If I just spin, they should slide off. And... Did not mean to hit the trailer. Sorry, forestry. Nobody saw that. No dents, no scratches. Alright, let's see. We head off in that direction. Well... Let's move up to the right. Yeah, up here looks better. We'll start here. And we will see if we can draw a straight line. That seemed okay. Now, where did I start the other row? And the rig is about 10 meters long, so... Over there to the white bush. How many times can we draw a straight line? The hard part of this job is figuring out where you left off, where you started. I may need to plow a straight line to start these from now on. Where the heck was the last tree at? There we go. That's the line. I wonder how funny it's going to look when these grow up. Well, that was quick. We're out of trees to plant now. I'm going to leave that there to mark where we finished. And let's run in. And we can afford three more pallets of trees. 
I think the forestry department should just give them to us. I may have to complain. Okay, let's go spend the last of our money. Uh, let's go this way this time. Find the tree, do our spacing. And hopefully we're going the right direction. I think I'm going to bring the trees back down here. Last pallet of trees. All done. I'm going to leave the planter here, that way we can put more trees on the trailer when we start next time. Ah, oh, darn it, they're closed. I never found out about my bonus yet. I guess we'll have to do that tomorrow. Well, we have to go back to the farm anyway, get our work done. That should be okay there. I don't think they'll yell at me.
I wonder what they're putting up at the log drop-off. Back to our wonderful farm. Hello, boys. Hey! Looky there! We got us a new windmill. It's all shiny. And it's working. I think they did a good job. Uh... But they didn't get rid of the old one. Hmm. Well, maybe that's mine to scrap. I don't know. It would be nice if I had the extra income from scrapping that, but I'm not sure if they'll let me do that or not. They must be going to come back tomorrow and finish. It does look pretty. Well, I gotta get back to work. We need to finish cultivating and fertilizing our new field. Field number three. Did I just make a mistake? I was supposed to cultivate first. And then fertilize. I don't think that fertilization is going to take. Darn it! Yeah, I think I'm going to do the animals now. No surprise. And no surprise. I wonder if there's a wild animal out here that is scaring the chickens. I think I've heard that an anxious chicken won't lay eggs.
Okay, let's go cultivate that field. Well, I had to turn my lights on, so I guess it might be getting a little too dark. I should probably quit so that I don't have an accident. I'll have to finish this up tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Humble Beginnings. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It would really help. See you soon. Bye for now.